Good morning, it's the 1st of December, can you imagine it, 2021. I'm Faye Ellington and I was just thinking that I should share something about Christmas and Jamaica and preparations for Christmas that um, some people know but some people may not be aware of. Well, you know that rice and peas is a part of the staple for most Jamaican meals, particularly on a weekend. But when it comes to Christmas, there is peas and peas and peas and peas. So most of us know the regular kidney beans, the red peas, and sometimes you find those that are round. And of course, gongo is one of those things that we look forward to at Christmas time. Uh, some people, gongo never do so well this year because there was a dry, dry, dry period. And then there was rain and fungus and things take over. And some people, goat going and yam down people, um, gongo. Why, that, that is our serious something, you know. But then there's something called Jerusalem peas or Christmas peas. And so I want to show you what the Christmas peas looks like. That's it. That's the Christmas peas or Jerusalem peas. Tiny, tiny, tiny red peas. You see how small they are? Tiny. But when you cook um, your rice and peas with this, the red color is just bold and bright. And, you know, you just want to, and the taste is fantastic. So that is the Jerusalem peas or Christmas peas. Uh, my mother always has a supply of it. And then I've come across two people now who have decided to give me stuff. And I really appreciate that. So introducing you to Christmas peas or Jerusalem peas, as some people call, call it. And preparing for Christmas is this kind of food focus for wherever you are in the world, whichever culture, whichever country. But this is something I thought I'd share with you. So whether you're going to make rice and peas with red peas, whether it's the kidney beans or the little round one or the wrong ones are not so little or you're going to use gungu and gungu of course you know can be green or dry well me not really like dry gungu more than so if, I, if it's given to me i'll have it but i love green gungu but this exotic thing here the jerusalem peas or the christmas peas i always look forward to getting some and preparing some at christmas time so just introduce you to a little bit to do with peas and Christmas and preparations because maybe not have sh if you never knew about it I know that I've shared it with you perhaps you can see if you can find some uh, to have for your Christmas meal and whether you are in North America or you're in some other part of the world maybe on the African content continent or you are in the Middle East whatever I know that at this time you ask relatives at home in Jamaica to either send you stuff or they decide to send you stuff without you asking or sometimes um, you can find them in shops where you are so here we go jerusalem peas christmas peas maybe i should show you again you know before i go here there we go with the jerusalem peas or the christmas peas so prepare for christmas i wish you a safe one remember wherever you are in the world covid is still a factor stay safe Follow your COVID protocols because a fourth surge is coming for some people and others, it's a fifth surge. Faye Ellington, reminding you to do a walk good.